Hello everyone, this is Joe Schlitzer with e &M. I'm one of our Siemens product specialists. I have another library for TI Portal that I wanted to bring to your attention. It's a super helpful add-in for TI Portal for the design and configuration of your HMI projects. It's called the HMI Template Suite for Somatic WinCC Unified. The HMI Template Suite is a library that significantly simplifies and speeds up the creation of a modern, practical, industrial optimized HMI design. It contains a broad selection of templates, images, and objects that you can use as a basis for your own HMI. Not only does Siemens provide the unified template suite, they also provide a wizard that works in conjunction with the HMI template suite. With the HMI template wizard, creating WinCC unified HMIs is even faster. The wizard accesses selected content of the library via TIA openness and merges them into your project. Now I'd like to show you how to quickly implement the HMI template suite and wizard into your own projects. To get started, you need to download and install the HMI template suite and wizard for WinCC Unified. There is an application example on the Siemens Industry Online Support site, which has download links and documentation. It's important that you review the documentation closely before installing, since there are TIA openness prerequisites that must be met in order for the wizard to function properly. A link to the application example will be in the description below. I've already gone ahead and installed the library and wizard. Here, I have a TI Portal project open with nothing added to my project. With the HMI template suite library already added, I can navigate down and find a device that has been pre-configured with screens and objects. I can simply drag and drop it over to my project in the project tree and it will add the device. Now, if I wish to use the wizard to add in a pre-configured HMI device, this is a separate application that lives outside of TI Portal. Here is the Somatic HMI Template Suite wizard. It's first prompt prompting me to select which type of navigation I want to use. Now it's asking me which device I wish to add. I want to connect it to my running project. Now it's building the device. Here I can enter in some additional project properties. And here I'm getting a preview of my HMI design, and I can select different objects and screens I wish to add to my HMI. And finally, here is a summary of my choices, and I can finish the wizard. And here is the device added to my project. And I can simply simulate the HMI to see how it looks. Thank you for your time today, and I hope you found this video useful for the creation of your future HMI projects.